this pressure that I was made for something better. My father gave the wrong impression. Reality was something different than I planned for. With nothing left to stand for. Not a bad night here. Um, saw one bear tonight. Hopefully he's back out tomorrow. I didn't get to see how good he was. He looked like a decent bear, but I didn't get to study him very hard. So it's a beautiful night tonight. Absolutely gorgeous. So I'm gonna have a little beer and some Cajun style jambalaya get a good night's rest be up early in the morning and hopefully we get something done I'm excited starting off with a good start here so here we go Friday night, a couple weeks into the season, I think we're two weeks in now, nothing but small bears and that big bear that I missed the other night, but I've been seeing quite a bit of activity up here in, my, in the unit I shot my bear in last year, so I know there's a lot more bears in here, I just haven't seen any yet, so just gonna hang out till dark and see what happens here. We're walking out to this little point and we got ourselves a really big bear so we're gonna get set up and see if we can get a shot. Well, we got her down the mountain. Matt went up to get the rope. Hi. And we're just gonna be able to rope this sucker up the hill. This will be the first thing I've never packed out. <laughs> so, 
It's a nice bear. It's an old bear. Barely got any teeth left. Old, old sow. So, yeah. Pretty excited to be done. This is the earliest I've ever shot a bear. So I'm tagged out and I can worry about Matt and Kyle and my dad and a special guest I got coming out in May. So, thanks for watching, guys. Cause I'm ready to die.